Hi, I am Kinjal and this is Art Sparks Season 3 Material Matters. In this season of Art Sparks, we explore some incredible ways of art making using highlight objects from the map collection. We also take inspiration from these works to DIY our own art pieces at home. Hope you're excited, let's begin. This episode is about the magical machines of the past called automatas. Never heard that word before? Take a couple of seconds to think about it. It is made up of two words, auto and matter. The word automata is the plural of automaton, which means acting of one's own will. An automaton generally refers to a moving mechanical device, usually constructed to look like a human or animal figure. Here is an automaton from the map collection. It features a couple of figures gathered around a small structure. When you look closely, you can also spot a tiger outside it. This figure inside the structure is the Hindu god Vishnu. You can see that he is blue and he's lying on a snake. Here is a small clip showing how it actually moves when the handle is rotated. Now that you have seen an automata, let's try and build a basic one. For this project, you will need a cardboard box, two bamboo skewers, two circular cardboard cutouts, a straw, glue gun, scissors and two identical cutouts of any figure you want to use. We are going to use these bees. First, cut out the front and the bottom of the box. On the top side, poke a hole in the center and two holes on the longer sides. Take a straw and pass it through the top hole. cardboard circles. Take a skewer and with the glue gun paste one end on one disc. Pass the skewer through the straw on the top of the box. Make sure the disc does not touch the back of the box. Take the second disc and poke a hole in the center and pass the skewer. Take the skewer and pass it through the two side holes in the box. Adjust the vertical and horizontal discs to make sure they touch each other. Stick your cutout figures on the skewer at the top. And that's it! Your first ever automata is done! Although this technique is centuries old, building automata still generates a lot of interest among artists and designers. Many modern products, such as toys and machines, still have roots in automata mechanics. Next time you come across a household machine or a toy, think of whether it could be an automata. See how many you can find in your own house. Share what you make with us via our social media handle or email you can subscribe to our YouTube channel as well to stay updated on all the other ArtSparks videos. Thank you for joining us. See you on the other side.